Hello everybody, welcome to a new series. This is Rogue Legacy 2, a sequel, long-awaited, much-anticipated sequel from one of the original roguelites from back in the days of your... Uh, one of the original very popular roguelites from back in its, uh, I guess, roguelite renaissance, you know, around the time that The Binding of Isaac came out, uh, and a few other, like, super popular ones. Anyway, I am really excited to finally get my hands on this. I've heard that there's not a lot of content in this as of yet because it's still early access. However, I have a lot of love for the original Rogue Legacy. So I figured dive in day one, have a good time, start a new legacy and uh, see how see how we can do, see what we can do. The time has passed and they have not returned. The estuaries have decayed. The kingdom demands deliverance. Sign the contract. And your children shall succeed you. Okay. I'll sign anything you want. Just let me play. There's a lot of stars. Once you cast off... There is no turning back. Already, this art style is so cool. Oh, it's even more hand-drawn than it was before. Unfortunately, the D-pad doesn't work. I hate, I hate using 2D platformers with the control stick. All right, we got a little bit of a tutorial on our hands. I imagine we're gonna immediately die. Hello? We've managed to cross the waters undiscovered. A few guards patrolled the west walls, but we were able to remove them without raising a signal. At sundown, we'll start ascending the wall. Provisions should be waiting for us at the top. J. Hold A to jump higher. All right. I got you. So, I assume what we're going to end up doing is uh, dying at the very beginning here. Oh, we do have analog movement. I don't know what the point would be. Go. Nope. Get me out of there. <laughs> Still got it, baby. I don't know if any of you have played the original Rogue Legacy, but in the tutorial section, like you literally just go through, you beat, you fight a boss that you can't hope to defeat, and then uh, you start the game for real. We bunkered in here for the past few days as Z and her spies prepped the west wall. They've rigged the trap doors ahead so we can open them from below. Tonight we make our move. There are heavier patrols ahead, but with all the fighting at the bridge, there should be no time for reinforcements. It seems I have a couple of spells already, too. Okay, so... If I hold down and hit the jump button again, I swing down. But if I... That's a really weird thing. Okay, so if I hit the attack button, no matter which direction that I'm holding the control stick, that's the direct, like, it's just going to swing left or right, just whatever way I'm facing. But I can do a little, like, kick if I... That's That seems very counterintuitive to me. Attack button should be attack at all times. Maybe it's because it's considered another jump, but that doesn't, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. It's a cool move. It's a cool move, though. Don't get me wrong. What is this? Oh, it's a teleporty. Hold on, is it a one-way? There's a... Yeah, there's, there's lore. We gotta get the lore. The diving bell cables we need to pass the interior ramparts were waiting for us just as Z promised. But our scouts underestimated how much we'd need. Just... We're just... <laughs> we're short a few hundred feet. Looks like we'll have to get creative with this one. Signed, J. Mr. J. <laughs> Why? That was kind of creepy sounding, actually. Uh, shortly after taking damage, A for an aerial recovery. You're going to make me damage boost? But damage boosting is intended. Interesting. Is that how I'm going to have to traverse some of this area? There was something... Dude, that's clearly a secret wall. You're lying to me, dude. You can't give me a cracked wall and tell me <laughs> too bad. That's not cool. 
Looks like I've underestimated Z and her charisma again. Below me, I can see the heads of all the misfits that have joined our ranks. When did so many rebels join? From here, it seems like an endless sea. This was supposed to be a suicide mission meant for only a few. She's unknowingly rallied these souls to a lost cause, and my mistakes keep growing. Mr. J. This is it, the end of the line. Below us, there's a trick door which can only be opened with magic. Z says it should lead us straight to the estuaries. So this is it. Tonight we live and die with the sins I've committed. Spells and talents cost mana. Restore mana by hitting enemies. Okay, that's a new feature. Oh, oh, hold on. Okay, that doesn't... So here's the thing. I'm gonna refill here. Then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna do a little bit of exploration on my own. It's gonna take me a little bit of time. Don't get me wrong. That's a shield, I believe. Yeah. So we're at max. We're gonna go back. Re-engage the music. Here we go. There wasn't supposed to be so many of us. It was only supposed to be a small sacrifice to pay for the kingdom's stability. Just a few words to a few ears. A reward for warning the kingdom of the incoming rebel attack. We were supposed to walk into a trap and be stopped. But he never planned to stop us. He wanted this war to happen. All I've done is give him time to prepare. Z, I'm sorry. I was just trying to save you. Win or lose, there's no redemption on my horizon. Mr. J. <laughs> All right, gonna climb through this yet again. I'm not gonna bother refilling my mana. Oh no, I've messed up. There's a there's a compelling reason there why uh, the kickflip should not be bound to the jump button. <laughs> All right, let's go. Ooh, more mana potions. Left bumper can also be used to open trap doors. So the flip kick is also bound to the L button? Or the left bumper button? Hmm. Well, this is the... Wait a minute. We didn't- we didn't die. No death. Heck yeah, dude. I'm not gonna die here. The frame rate feels really choppy for some reason. I don't know what happened. Oh, a bookshelf? Can I- can I read you? Can I read you? I can't read you. I remember this enemy. Wow, he's got a much higher uh, rate of fire than I'm used to. Don't you do it. So I've already taken damage. If there's one thing that I remember about Rogue Legacy, it's just how difficult it is to maintain high health and uh, get healed. Do those spikes come back? Oh. Max mana. Alright, I, I am liking this a lot more so far. The core of this feels really good. All I need is a D-pad and I'll be happy. Not Sam. I don't need sand. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I am so bad! I am not... <laughs> I'm not proud of what just happened. You know what? I blame the fact that the attack speed was so low. Dwarfism. Puritan. This one has no traits. Magma Mass. Summon a massive ball of magma to crash it down on your foes. Passes through terrain. They all have shield block. Let's go with the uh, little Sir Kenny. Little Sir Kenny is going to be our next boy. Socialism at its worst. Traits now give gold modifiers. 
Oh, nice. That's what I was talking. I was like, I was streaming last night and I was talking about this game and I was talking about how uh, the traits should have some sort of positive bonus attached to them. Just, you know, to make them a little more worth using. Your kingdom has decided to tax the rich to care for the poor. A contentious decision for sure, but let's see how it pans out. See, dwarfism gets plus 20%. Normal guy, he gets taxed extra. Uh, socialism just got worster. Increases gold gain for certain traits. I don't think we can afford it. Yeah, it costs 1500. We can get archery range for the ranger class. Cool, more classes. Bows for foes. Rain down the pain and fletch foes from afar with an assortment of arrows. Rangers can't take a lot of hits, but they don't have to when they're shooting enemies from a million miles away. Would I like to switch? Uh, sure. Uh, we have 150 gold, so we can unlock one of these. Let's start with the blacksmith. Good old blacksmith. But what he lacks in creativity, he makes up for in age. Gather blueprints for him and he'll strain his tired bones to the limit in order to craft you the most exquisite armaments you've ever seen. This is nice music. I'm liking it. You are tiny. Oh, okay. I can, like, I can extra jump just by aiming down. So I can see why, um... I can see why the control stick is required. Because it's going to be hard to move. Or it's going to be hard to aim with a D-pad in multiple directions. That's why Ori uses the control stick, too, because of the way Bash works. Thanks for helping me build my black shop, kid. I ain't got a lot to my name, but I promise you, your investment will be in he into this here blacksmithery will pay off black wisely. I can't make much right now because I don't have any blueprints, but if you and me work together, boy, we can start making some unimaginable things. And I mean that literally. Got me some of that aphantasia. Can't see no pictures up in this noggin. That's why I need those blueprints. So here's the deal. You get me blueprints and I'll charge you money to make them. It's a win-win. I win because I get free blueprints. And then I win again because I get a customer. <laughs> now let's stop dilly-dallying and let me show you what I got in the black back of this black shop. <laughs> blueprints not found. I can't afford any of this. You know why? I ain't got no cash. My wallet's full of nothing. <laughs> Are we going to have the car on, fella? At the, yeah, there he is. One must pay the fee. Yeah, you can have all my gold, sucker. Yeah, <laughs> spent it all, idiot. Yeah, load. Load faster. Here we go. Citadel Agarita. Oh. I can see this being a little bit... Difficult to deal with. Oh my gosh. Hello. Okay. Aiming is hard. Oh, and there's a lot of lag with it too. I hit him. Great. Oh! Oh, what? I'm gonna die again immediately, dude. Oh. I'm so bad at this. Dude, I lured him into a false sense of security and then ruined his life. Oh, those those platforms disappear whenever I uh, whenever I touch them. Yeah, it's just that's not, not going to go anywhere. All right, I get some mana. Um, that creates a little bit of platform for me. That's super nice. That's going to be super useful as long as I don't, you know, just immediately die. You know, just make sure that. Uh, Make sure that they don't kill you. All right. I have no dash. I believe that's going to be something that I unlock later. Because that was something you unlock a little bit later in the original Rogue Legacy. Movement feels pretty good. Pretty snappy. It feels like Rogue Legacy feels. Get a treasure chest. Heck yeah. Why did the, the gold fall away? I need magnet. I need my magnet. Oh, hello. Did not expect that to actually do anything. Uh. 
Um, got a chest up there. This better be worth it. Leather weapon. A beautiful piece of piece of weathered leather. A beautiful piece of weathered leather. You can't see me, but I am face palming so hard right now. Oh, <laughs> that sucked. Oh man, I didn't even realize my health was that low. Oof. All right, we made it literally one room deeper into the castle. Ivy lookout, searing shot, blaze bellow, gravity beam. Yeah, let's antiquarian. Let's be the antiquated ranger. What is this? Increases max weight capacity? Like, that's gonna do anything for me. Uh, let's just unlock the enchantress. We can see what she does. That was, that was all of our gold. Don't let her height fool you. The enchantress is smaller than she looks. Find runes for her and she can imbue, the, uh, imbue you with magical powers, granting you the ability to siphon life from your foes, redirect damage, and improve your magical repertoire. Cool. Increases max rune capacity. Oh my god. Everything is retro. Oh my god. These pixels are in, like, weird 3D. I don't understand what's happening with the way these pixels look. It's a little... off. <laughs> Here, have a blueprint, my guy. Leather weapon. How much does it cost? 225 for a crappy piece of leather? Are you kidding me? Oh, Ducky, thank you so much for this extravagant tent. The ancient car flowing through it is so immense, it's making me dizzy. Just kidding, I saw the price tag. You suck. Uh, the only thing making me dizzy are the fumes from all the cleaning agents I had to use. Couldn't you get a girl anything better? Well, beggars can't be choosers, so I've decided not to be poor anymore. Now let's talk about magic with a capital M for Megabucks. Because let me tell you, Ducky, enchantments ain't cheap. Go bring me some of those sweet runic stones and I'll have you dancing around with a capital D for diarrhea because of all the side effects. Yeah, you know, D could stand for something else. <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. You know, understand what I'm putting down, you're getting... Alright, enough of that. Let the load go. Let the load happen. This is... This is a rough setup we got going on. Let's break everything. Max mana already. This is gonna be a hard time for me to like actually see things. Watch me do better than I've ever done in my life. Watch me immediately beat the game. Whoa! That was brilliant shooting on my part. That was terrible shooting on- oh my god. There we go. <laughs> He's finally dead. I hope those don't disappear if I wait too long. That would be pretty tragic. All right, it's much easier to destroy these with a bit of a, a kickflip. And I'm also now understanding why the kickflip is bound to the A button and not the sword swing button, because you don't always end up with a sword in this in this one. So it makes sense. What does this do? It's just a... Oh! That didn't feel very good. Don't let the traps get you. I said don't let the traps... Don't let them get you. It's fine. You know what? We'll come back to it later. Ugh. I want to kill him. There it is. He healed because I had left. Oh my god. I don't like it. Hold on. Can I shoot myself? I know this is ill-advised. Okay. I had to be sure. How are you immune to that? And I'm not- oh my god. Skeleton. 
Get him. I got him. Oh, boy. He didn't even... Oh, he didn't even drop anything. Oh! Big oof. Oh. This eyeball is a problem. Shoot, dude. Oh! Okay. Level 10? What is this level 10 crap? Oh, that's not a thing I can hurt. Alright, we're up to 209 money. It's not our best yet. Yes. That's what we call maximum efficiency, maximum safety. Uh-huh. Be burned, fool. Hey. <laughs> it's kind of a nice spell. I like that. I don't know if I want to go up there. I think I'm going to say no. Just for now. I mean, it's not like it's going to be there when I die. Oh, okay. So as soon as you jump... It gets destroyed. I've learned a thing. I've learned a thing. Very painfully, in fact. Oh my god, this room sucks! I tried! Apparently, uh, if you aim down, <laughs> you get a little bit of hit stunned on yourself. There was a chest in that room. Two of the rooms. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna go with the bow. How come you can't see his bow? Pacifist? Let's not go for pacifist. That sounds difficult. Uh, let's, uh, let's spend our money on weapons. Actually, maybe armor. 150% weapon damage, 150% armor. Wow. Where is it? Where is it? Sir Gordon. Wait, there's silver? Or is that platinum? It's probably platinum. Um, where are my traits at? Oh, it's down at the bottom. 150% uh, weapon damage, half health, and half magic. That's... That's pretty good for somebody who's as brilliant at this game as I am. Yeah, right. We can increase our damage by two. Probably should have grabbed the helm first, but you know what? We only have 50 bucks. It's enough to actually buy that, so we'll do that. Uh, unlocks offshore investments. Interesting. Unlock barbarians. Unlocks the mage. Cool, cool, cool. Wait, did I attack the roof? Suck it, roof. Alright, let's go. This is usually how most of my runs in Rogue Legacy go. I do a lot of exploration, and one day or another, like, one run or another, I get, uh, pretty lucky. And I start doing pretty well. But I think it's gonna take me a while to, <laughs> to get comfortable enough. Uh, to be decent enough to get very far in this game. Especially if I do stuff like that. That was foolish. Don't let him. Dude, I am frightened. There's so many... I'm not ready for these traps! It's the first fucking room! Oh my god, I'm mad. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I try not to curse on this channel anymore, but... Oh, man. Oh! Give me that sword. Give me that sword, dude. I am mad at that one. I am upset. How much money did I get? 40? That ain't nothing. That's... Uh, you know what? This is better than... Oh, I can't... Oh, I got double jump? I got double jump. The, ba the past was a blast. Everything is old-timey tented. I got a double jump. 
That's nice. Except my like normal jump is kind of weak. No, wait a minute. Two, three. I got a triple. Two, three, four. I caught a quadruple jump. Dude, if I can't make this one work. Uh, if I can't make this one work, then I might as well quit now. <laughs> Man, I look so slick when I go- oh! Did I leave the gold? Wait, how do- what does the magic 8-ball do? Each ricochet raises its, its damage. Oh! I aim it. Hold on, how am I supposed to- Do I have to do the world's smallest kiss here? Okay. A little bit of a kiss goes a long way. Like a Hershey's kiss. Just be very careful. Don't let them intimidate you. It's gonna be okay. Oh, these platforms work that same way. I just didn't realize it the first time that I ran into them. Oh! He almost got me. I'll admit that. God, I need to raise my attack speed. Or I just need to get used to, <laughs> to the attack speed of this character. Look at all these dead knights. There's a lot of them. Oh my gosh. Worst thing about wearing headphones, if your ear itches, you gotta adjust. Um. What is this? What is this? A nanke of the shawl. Oh, who hast? Who here has stumbled into my abode? Sweet child, hast thou lost thine way? I am Anantke of the Shawl. I am an heirloom, an item of immeasurable power, and I can grant my power to those I deem worthy. Those who typically seek me are hardened, powerful warriors, but you, dear child, are soft and pudgy. Very pudgy. Inside me lays the power of momentum. Conquer my challenge and my power is yours, but I warn you, child, the dangers are real and the consequences severe. Enter the heirloom. No. Now I will enter the heirloom. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Is this a boss? Or is this like a challenge room? There's water on the ceiling. That's weird. Right trigger to dash. All right. Is this the whole challenge? No, oh, that was the tutorial. Oh, oh don't you... Oh, my good gracious. Oh, my God. Help. Dude, the knockback is killing. Oh, no! This is cursed. Are you kidding me? I hate it. I hate it. Ugh. Okay. No, sir. Oh! Why are there so many things to do? Does this mean I can rest? Oh!
Can this be it? Why is this challenge so expense like so crazy? I was oh, I was supposed to dash there. happening what is happening right now am i sideways i guess not anymore i am invalidating a lot of this challenge <laughs> just because i have this quadruple jump and it allows me to do whatever i want i did it fairly congratulations sweet child you've pr proven yourself worthy now come and claim your inheritance the power of momentum and let our souls bind together He's done it. Ananke's shawl is mine. Wait. And, uh... All of my health is missing now, so that's great. Oh, these come back. Okay. Unfair. I disagree with that. But whatever. All right, what am I going to get murdered by this time? Cut blade? Not today. <gasps> Chicken! Chicken and cash. I need more chicken, please. Special. Hold on. I see, I know why that one was special. Why is this one special? Just because there was a chest there? Oh. Duh! What? No! I didn't see the, I didn't see the damage there. No. <laughs> that was heartbreaking. What was that question mark? What was that room? I don't understand what that room was. All right, what do we got? We got, uh, wait until next episode, because you know what? That's gotta be it for this one. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna try and be better. And, uh, hopefully I'll see you there. Bye-bye.